Um, so flexing this controls the walking, so by flexing my finger, I start walking. And then by just looking down the path, I control my direction. There's a bridge, let's look at the bridge. And cross it. And I also have a sensor in the thumb to control jumping, so if I press the thumb, you jump. And there is another sensor on the bottom of my hand, so if I flex my hand up, you go to the top-down view, and if I flex it again, you go back to the regular view. So again, let's go back onto the throwing platform. And in this case, uh, the same movement triggers zooming. So we're now I zoom in to focus on the targets more closely. Uh, instead of jumping, the thumb sensor is now throwing. So if I just press my thumb on the sensor and throw a coconut. And again, aiming at the targets, uh, I simply do by moving my eyes across the screen. Right. So right now I beat the game, I hit all targets in the right amount of time. So again, I can walk. And then I have this little headset here that measures my brain signals and by switching that on I can control walking by just thinking that I want to go there. So I can look around, in which case I don't walk, and then I can trigger walking by thinking I want to go to the place where I'm looking at. Follow the path, just thinking and looking, that's all I'm doing right now. Path. Go more to the right. There's a plane over there. Let's go check it out. Also, look towards the bridge. kind of hard to aim specific, like very precisely with the eyes because it's sort of un unprecise with the, the rotations, but sometimes it works out. Alright, let's go over this hill again. Let's go left. Keep following the path. 